Have you ever just laid around and looked at the clouds, see what kind of shapes you see? Like that one. That one looks like a dog. That looks like a dragon. Oh, that could be a really cool community science project. NASA needs your help collecting data about clouds using its GLOBE Observer app. GLOBE, or Global Learning and Observations to Benefit the Environment, connects community members and scientists from all over the world to conduct real hands-on experiments to learn more about their local environment. Today, we're gonna collect data on clouds, and the app helps you do that, but first, we're gonna go over some of the basic types of clouds that you're gonna see. Contrails are long, straight clouds left behind by airplanes, and they're usually really high in the sky. Cirrus clouds are also really high in the sky, but usually look more like horse tails. Stratus clouds are more like blankets that cover the sky. Cumulus clouds are light and fluffy. They usually look like cotton balls or cauliflower. Nimbus clouds are rain clouds and be, can be categorized as cumulonimbus or nimbostratus clouds. So why are we observing clouds at all? Clouds are really important to help us understand local weather events and the Earth's climate. NASA has satellites that are collecting data and observing these clouds from above, but NASA also needs our help to observe these clouds from below because we can see details that they can't from their satellites. Download the Globe Observer app and set up a free account. The app will walk you through all the details. For this activity, you'll select Globe Clouds and choose New Observation. From there, the app will help you start collecting data on the clouds you see, such as the amount of cover, the color of the sky, and the type of cloud. So you can go to our website and find this really handy cloud observation tool. Then you can download the Globe app, create an account, and you're ready to go outside and start your observations. Download instructions for this and other STEM at home activities at smv.org/stayconnected.